What's up, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? Pyrostasis here, and I am with Rodri22. He's going to be showing me his entrance uh, for the underwater layer contest. Now, we're going to do a quick flyby here. You can see this is, is what I can see of his base from, um, from the air. Now, it does look like he's built in rather shallow areas, and he's limited glass. So from above view, you can't really see much except for that, and that could kind of be looking like lava. So that's kind of nice, you know, if there were any airplanes flying over, people wouldn't be able to see. All right, so Rodri's gonna go ahead and show us. We're gonna follow him down and see what we've got. So we've got a nice little water entrance there. Might scare people since they don't know how deep they'll have to go. Nice little fire set up there. Let's see what we've got deep on in. Ah, all the doors are airlocks. I like it. So it keeps people from coming in. That is good stuff. Not sure what those are. All right. Got a nice little uh, NPC dude. R the training room. All right, let's go into the, damn it. Got some, uh, Buttons here. Whoa! Oh my god! Oh, that is badass! Ah! That is awesome. That is absolutely awesome. I like that. So you press the button and the doom switch is flipped. And then uh, the baddies come out and hurt me. That is that is badass. I like that. Alright, room three base control. So let's press this button. Whoops, I may have flipped it too many times. Try it again. There we go. Nice, lights on. I like that a lot. That is cool. Oh, so he's got like the DEF CON 4 system there. That's good shit. I like that a lot. Not sure what that did. Oh, okay. It opened this up. All right, I'll stand here. Oh, water comes down. Nice. So I guess you can flood the underwater layer here and kill everybody if you have to. It's like a, uh, it's like the doom switch. You know, shit's. Shit's going down. It's a self-destruct signal. You trigger it and everything goes down. I like that. It's also an escape. Okay. Maybe I went too far. Oh, yes. Yes, I did. Oh. There we go. Good, good luck. And just so you know, if water gets no this thing... All right, so this is our little escape track here. I like this. I'm not sure if he's got something set up. I'm assuming there was a cart there. So you hit the cart and it will take you down and get you out. That is, that is badass. Holy shit. This thing is epic, dude. Oh my god. Got some nice little squids. They're like, what's up, bro? This is badass, dude. So yeah, this is the awesome escape hatch. I like this. The coolest escape hatch ever. Holy shit, dude. It's like an epic... Minecart ride. Oh my god. All right, so here is the cart. Not sure if we can send it back. Nice. And then from here, we exit the place. How do we exit? Must be a switch. Ah, there it is. Here we go. And this allows us to exit. 
and gets a safe once again. Nice. And we're in the jungle. That is badass. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and do one more fly back across so you can see how epic this thing is because Pyro missed this the first time. This place is fucking huge. Holy crap. How did I miss this before? Wow, this is epic. Yeah, so I, I guess I just didn't look far enough. Very cool. So he, he's got the first actual escape shaft. And that will, you hit that, you go up the water, and you hit that little cart, and it will take you to the end. So that is that is cool. And put you over there in that other biome. It's a totally different chunk, and you can escape quite easily. Cool beans. All right, guys. Well, if you thought that Rodri should win this contest, then click the link in the description. It's going to take you to a Facebook poll and allow you to vote. Uh, vote for the one you think should win there. Hope you guys are liking the series. If you do, please click that like button. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my other videos, tips, tricks, and guides. I'll catch you guys in the next clip.